Hey, what is up, guys, and welcome back to The Evil Within 2. So, this game just keeps getting complex and complex. But we're going to see how that goes. Um, we're going to see how much more complicated it can get. Uh, so, let's the fun begin, right? Here, I'm going to talk to Torres real quick. Let me ask you a few more questions before... You said Myra was supposed to stay behind to take care of Mobius. How? By using STEM against them. The chip allows them access and benefits that normal citizens don't have. And you let them put those things inside you? It's not like we were given much of a choice. Myra was supposed to send a signal back through STEM that would neutralize every member of Mobius via their brain chips. Basically like a mass remote control lobotomy. That's one way to solve the problem, I guess. If we don't do it, Mobius will just put Lily back in STEM and kill all of us for mutiny. It's the only way. I can't believe Kidman's behind all of this. She sent me into Beacon. She stood by while Lily was put into STEM. It doesn't... You're an outsider, Sebastian. You don't know what Kidman is really like. But why now? Why not when they were building the new STEM? We need STEM to send the signal to take Mobius down. When Lily was chosen as the core, Myra and Kidman decided it was time to put everything into effect. The way things are going now, this could be our only chance to pull this off. So how did Theodore Wallace get mixed up in this? It was Theodore's idea of sending the signal through STEM. Now that I think about it, he probably just wanted to take over Mobius for himself. Damn it. I knew he wasn't trustworthy. That guy's slippery like a snake. But that's his game. He can convince people of anything. He convinced us that he was here to help us. Yeah. I've known people like that. They always seem like they're your best friend. Until they stab you in the back. One minute I was in a tidal wave of blood in Theodore's hellhole. The next thing I know, I'm in that house with you. I still don't understand how you found me. Me either. I was scouting the area around my safe house for supplies when I heard a girl's voice coming from that abandoned house. I went to investigate. No girl, but you were there. It's almost like I was led to you. A girl's voice? It had to be Lily. But how? There's no telling how or why things happen in here. Stem was already unpredictable before she escaped. But now? <sighs> I stopped trying to make sense of things a long time ago. Uh, you and me both. Let me see if my cat's back. Kitty? Oh, there you are, kitty. My cat's safe, guys. Everything's alright. Okay, time to go back out there. Let's go right. deeper into Matrix. Let's hope the marrow is still there. Interesting. All right, let's see what we're gonna find. It's a radio signal. Time to flip some switches. That was the easiest one I ever did. Anybody Shit. here? Shit. Looks like Theodore's been here. Maybe that's why I couldn't contact O'Neill. 
Hoffman's safe house is nearby. I should check up on her. Sykes? Oh, God. Another team member... down. I should have listened to him. I should have helped him out. <sighs> I'm gonna be mad if I missed out on a weapon or something. I don't know how you got down here. But okay. It's okay. It's okay. You just gotta believe, right? Yes. You were in your safe house. Nothing was supposed to get in. Well, good night, my friend. Sleep tight. Oh look, blood leading to the doorway. Everything's all right. Hoffman, you here? Another one of these. What happened here? Liam, is that you? Liam. safe house to go to a restricted area of the marrow? That doesn't sound like him. It's not on you, man. It's not O'Neill. I didn't even see this area before. Just a Hey, you are messing with the light, better stop it. I can like see what's out there, okay, when I open these doors. Okay, the coast seems clear for now. Just checking. Looks like they had extra security for this place. See, so had. Add extra security. Clearly, these people only had one life. I get to start over every single time I die. Ho ho ho. This room is gonna be fun. I can tell. Everything reloaded. Cool. I'm ready for this. All these tanks. What's this about? Alright, where's the big bad monster I'm supposed to fight? Hello? Anybody? Anybody want to test me today? Because I may not kill you the first time, but the second time you better watch out. All right, let's go through here. Hello? Huh. 
can't pass through without one of those chips. Gotta be one around here somewhere. All right, let's go upstairs. Maybe the key card's up there. All right, let's see if I can take these guys out. So the most I can only get one of them. And I'll take one. See what they want to say. Have been in vain. The core escaped less than a day ago. Within hours, we began to receive reports of lost emerging in staggering numbers. They're everywhere now. 20% of Union's populace has succumbed already, and they're actively hunting down and killing whoever is left. It's a nightmare. At this rate, there will be no one left in two weeks. We've lost contact with Mobius. We're trapped in here with the lost. It's too late to stop now. The entire Union experiment is doomed. We're all doomed. I'm sorry. It's okay. None of y'all better get up, okay? We better stay on the gurney and stay there. Interesting indeed. Let's go see what's in here. here. If they haven't removed this guy's chip yet, I can use it to get through that door and find Hoffman. He's already dead. I gotta get out of this lab. Of course. Of course you guys want to turn the power off. And now it begins. Yeah, it looks like we had a couple cores missing. Great. I love it. First guy down. Go to sleep. Pretty please. Oh no. No 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 no. Just leave me alone guys, gosh. Alright, I'm gonna use the explosive bolt. Come on baby. Seriously, you're still alive? I 
to run. Come on. You need to stop grabbing me. Alright, I got this, I got this. Come closer. Stomp. Thank you. I didn't even want to use that explosive bullet on your bitch ass, but it just happened. Hmm. Got one of those, so let's see. Uh, all right, let's see what's behind here. Are these Union citizens? What was Mobius doing with them? And go down this hallway of dead bodies. Looks like it goes down forever. All right, zombies, where are you? Oh no, it's coming. I gotta get out of here. No, lady, you're not getting me. It's not gonna happen, I'm telling you. Or you might. No. Damn it. Not as scary death as I thought it would be. But let's hope we can get out of here, right? Alright. Let's keep moving. Don't turn around. La la la. Alright, I guess I gotta go downstairs. Let me go. I have a wife and kid to save. Gosh. I hate you, crazy lady. You know that, right? 
always coming uninvited to my mind. She always does this. Thanks for rearranging the room. I love it. the first time you did it. Why you gotta do it again, huh? Just let me go. Stop creating a new maze after a new maze. And she changes it again. Really, girl? Can't make up your mind, huh? I thought she was gonna get me there. And I'm... I'm out of here, haven't I? Wait, more images. Okay, I'm going to cool. have to do with this place. Cool, cool, cool. All right, I think it's this way. Ooh, ammo. Cool. Oh, sprinklers. Interesting. This is gonna be fun. I have a feeling I'm facing some fire related guy. showed me the way. I am his now. I helped him hide. And in exchange, he gave me a new life. A life as a slave. You'll never understand. For that, you'll burn! Man, that flamethrower has some damage. Get too hot in here. 
Just because you got a flamethrower and a new face doesn't mean you're strong, Liam, okay? Well, I messed that up. Are you ready for my shocking surprise? Electrifying, isn't it? Here's more. I got one more for you. Oh yeah, you love it. Ooh, did I make you mad? Oh, you're just playing with me? Okay, we'll see about that. Theodore. I told him, let the flame okay, maybe we weren't playing around. Okay. Really, bro? I think I almost had him. I just have to uh, avoid those fires a whole lot better. But we got him next time, guys. We got this. Round two begin. Ouch, bro. You're good at burning me. Literally. I think you need to cool down. Here, let's have some... Let's have a shocking twist to the story. I'm into this fight. Ah, oh, you got me that time. Tag, you're it. Mmm, you love it, don't you? Missed that time. Alright, stop chasing me, okay? Getting too hot in here. Gotta put the flames out. I wonder where I went. All right, I'm gonna craft some more. Uh, I'm gonna craft some explosive bullets, explosive bolts, and uh, shock bolts. Sure. Some sniper rifle ammo would be good. Uh, I thought I had a set on uh, ex uh, explosive, but I guess not. First explosive one. How do you like that, huh? You want another one? Well, you got me in, got me in the process, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, this guy is taking everything, and he's, I don't even think he's nowhere near down yet. He didn't even take his mask off again. Well, I messed with that. Did I not hit you that time? There's one. I can do this.
Come on, bro. Ah, oh, there you are. Time to run. Let's put down some fires. Smokey the Bear would approve. Damn it, this fire didn't go out. Come to me, Daddy. Come. Oh, almost. Well, I don't have enough ammo. I mean, enough gunpowder to make any more stuff. So that's great. Uh, at least I have a uh, seven med kit, and I should be able to make another one. Thank you, finally. Take that mask off and face me. Let me see that face. That's it. I'm done playing with you. That's good. I won't go down easy. Yeah, I know you won't go down easy. You just took like a lot of headshots right there with my pistol. But no, you're still alive, so let's keep going. Alright, I gotta make that medkit now. Please don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Alright, cool, good. Time to run and regroup. Yes, Father Theodore. I told him. Amount of stamina and everything. Come on, bro. Let's go. Let the flames Damn it. His tank blocked the tank I was trying to shoot. Seriously. Ouch. Oh man, this game dangerous. I really don't want to try to face him again, you know. Come on, bro. Really, I didn't get him. Okay. All right, inching closer and closer to that, am I? No problem. All right, I got one headshot, and now my life's all the way down. <laughs> this is getting intense, guys. I don't wanna. I don't want to die again. My body's not ready. Okay, I guess I got two harpoon bolts. What else do I got? I don't even think I can miss any more shots. If I do, I'm dead. Okay, I don't even think it did anything, anything to him. Pretty sure I got both of them in. Thank you. I really thought I was gonna die here. Holy crap, that was close. Thank you, Sebastian. Finally, free from his voice. From my fears. Uh, 
I was so scared. You've got to stop him. I can't stop him if I can't find him, O'Neill. He phase shifted. He's not here. Not anywhere. The machine in the room next door. You've got to destroy it. What machine? He made me build it. To hide him. Destroy it. So that you can destroy him. I'll do that, O'Neill. Sorry, man. What happened? How did O'Neill get turned into that thing? I don't know. I've been locked in my safe house since you left. When Liam called and asked me to meet him, I was so relieved to hear his voice. But he wasn't Liam. He was that thing. I tried to get through to him, but... You heard him. Theodore Wallace did something to him. Poor guy. I didn't want to have to kill him. You didn't have a choice. Theodore wasn't going to give him up. So what now? Let's take a look at this machine O'Neill was talking about. I think it's on the other side of the room where you found us. Let's go. Yep, let me take this. Flamethrower. I could use this, but it's broken. If I found the right parts... Lots of weird stuff in here. Looks like he was building something. Maybe that machine he was talking about. All right, I'm gonna go in here real quick. I'm gonna save. Okay, let's go back and see what that machine was. Mark of influence. Theodore's sticking his fingers in every part of this place. It's almost like a form of communication with him. So you know Theodore Wallace? Of course. He's head of recruitment. But what's he doing in STEM? And why is he doing this? There's a lot going on that you don't know about. Theodore wants Lily for himself. You saw what he did to O'Neill. He'll do that to everybody in here if he has to. He'll tear this place apart to get his hands on her. I can't let that happen. Well, that's a somewhat interesting machine with candles all around. What is it? I'm not totally sure, but it looks a hell of a lot like the stable field emitter. Whatever it is, O'Neill said to destroy it. 
So that's what I'm gonna do. And I know just how. It's me. Sebastian. I'm starting to think you forgot about me. Have you finished arming that cookie dough of yours? I have. Looking for an excuse to use it, too. Lots of weird stuff in here. Looks like he was building something. Maybe that machine he was talking about. All right, I'm gonna go in here real quick. I'm gonna save. Let's go back and see what that machine was. Mark of influence. Theodore's sticking his fingers in every part of this place. It's almost like a form of communication with him. So you know Theodore Wallace? Of course. He's head of recruitment. But what's he doing in STEM? And why is he doing this? There's a lot going on that you don't know about. Theodore wants Lily for himself. You saw what he did to O'Neill. He'll do that to everybody in here if he has to. He'll tear this place apart to get his hands on her. I can't let that happen. Don't worry, man. We won't let that happen. Well, that's a somewhat interesting machine with candles all around. What is it? I'm not totally sure, but it looks a hell of a lot like the stable field emitter. Whatever it is, O'Neill said to destroy it. So that's what I'm gonna do. And I know just how. It's me. Sebastian, I'm starting to think you forgot about me. Have you finished arming that cookie dough of yours? I have. Looking for an excuse to use it too. Good. I'm sending you my coordinates. Bring the big guns. We're going hunting. Got it. I'm already gone. See you soon. Wow, you got here pretty quick. I'm almost ready over here. Let me know when you're good to go. All right, let's talk I to you, Kiko. Clarify a few things. You didn't seem surprised to see Esmeralda here. Why should I be? She's just going to ask you some questions. Everybody knows everybody in Mobius, huh? More like I know everybody. Like one big dysfunctional family. Esmeralda's the best person to have around in Dangerous. You're damn right I am. I assume you know Myra, too? I do. We work together closely. How could she do this? How could she tell Lily that I was dead? Myra's maternal instinct is very strong. And the word experiment is a bit harsh. Lily was treated well, and she was able to interact with her mother on a daily basis. As far as telling Lily you were dead, I believe... Yeah, well... I Hopefully, you can work this all out as a family when this is all over. I've been into Theodore. If it's a reflection of his psyche, he's definitely got some serious mental issues. That would explain why he's so powerful. And yet he's hiding. Perhaps it's easier to manipulate from the shadows. Well, I'm about to drag him out of the shadows. If what Liam told us was true... There's only one way to find out. I don't know if you should be in here when this thing goes off. I don't think I want to be. There were some interesting items in the other room that Liam was working on. I want to go check and see if there's anything that might... Okay. But then you should get back to your safe house. No telling what will happen in here once we shut this thing down. Will do. Alright. Let's blow this place up, guys. Tell me something, Torres. So you knew... Everybody knows Hoffman. If you don't get into mo- Can she be trusted? I might have said no before, but nothing- She's trapped in here like the rest- hmm. Yeah, she's not bad. Just a bit of a cold fish. I have trouble completely trusting people who look at me like I'm something in a petri dish. I don't know what's gonna happen when- Me either. But at least we're being proactive. He doesn't seem like the kind of guy who can be talked into doing the right thing. So you're giving me orders to shoot on sight? I'm just saying be prepared for anything. No offense, but how did someone as smart and headstrong as you wind up in an organization like Mobius? I was a demolitions expert in the army. They loaned me out to Mobius for some black ops stuff. Once my term was up, they came knocking. And you just joined up like that? They were pretty good salesmen. They don't tell you everything when you sign up. I was... 
tasked with some things that I'm not proud of. They expect you to follow blindly, and if you disobey... When Myra offered me the opportunity to get out, I had to take it. I've still got some morals left, despite the things that I've had to do. All right, let's blow this thing up. Is that enough to take care of this thing? Like ten times over. And it's ready to go when you are. Let's do I'm it. To go. I'm going to check out the equipment in the other room. Good luck, you two. Okay, here we go. Operation Kick Ass happening in three, two, one. Well, I think you did it. Are you okay, Torres? Torres? Where'd you? Sebastian Castellanos. You refused to step into the darkness. So you tried to bring me to the light. Huh? Your rash decisions have always been your downfall. Come then, I await you. You want to find your beloved daughter? Go there. See if it's everything you dreamt of. Here. I'm over here, Dad. I'm coming, Lily. Your papa's coming to save you. Actually, guys, I think I'm gonna stop it right here. I know I kept you guys on edge. Um, if you like what you saw, please uh, comment, like, even subscribe. Thanks for watching. Peace.